안녕하세요 여러분 제 이름은 아시람 코치 엄마의 남자예요 오케이 so this is my new studio guys yeah but it is not finished yet so I'm sure you can see that there is something new at the back right but that little 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 combo so that is my new channel logo and it is fully in Hangul so if you guys can read it just read it okay so basically there is going to be a new video that explains all about this and what at the back make sure you watch it when it comes out soon then let's get back to the topic at hand so today I would like to talk about a topic which is very near to my heart which is how I first met Korea and what made me attracted to Korea in the first place okay so from what I can remember my first introduction to Korea was when I was seven years old. So you might be thinking like seven years old? That's a freaking kid. Primary school kid. What do they do? What do they know? So what does a seven year old kid in the nineties have that makes him so inter interested in Korea? The answer? Well, let me tell you. It was something that is very close to the Korean culture. So wanna take a guess? You attack one, two, three. Ding ding ding. It is Taekwondo. <laughs> I was introduced basically to Taekwondo from when I was seven years old and I practice it until now. So basically, Taekwondo is a form of martial arts that is originated from Korea. I'm sure you guys know that, right? Right, right. It's not Japan. So as a kid, I was like very excited watching this martial art people watching Jackie Chan, looking uh, everything all right so as I grow up it became a part of my life so you know it's training going from white belt until the black belt it's cool right right right, right. so what did you know um, I am currently a certified second dan cookie one black belt holder awesome right so for your information, Cookie One is the official governing organization for Olympic and WTF style of Taekwondo. So that means if you are registered and get certified by them, you are basically a legit and recognized black belt in the whole world so you can practice your Taekwondo anywhere and people won't judge. And I guess that by learning in their martial art ways throughout my whole life basically it actually fascinates me when I see something that is of Korean culture you know? so I just kind of love the culture itself the food um, the language the music the drama and the list goes on and on and on and on same way as I love with Taekwondo if I don't know I also love music I'm sure you know that and when I hear Korean music particularly those seen by the powerhouse ballad singers I was blown away like literally so top you know so it was so good that I just keep on hearing it and you know accidentally doing some covers for some of them so you can actually check out the Korean covers on my channel as well and see I got some promotion here <laughs> so if you like it don't forget to leave a thumbs up subscribe and also press the bell notification button all right mm, okay so since then there are many things that actually keeps making me more fall in love with korea mm, such as did you guys know about running man ah, yeah i'm sure you know about it it's a worldwide phenomenon right it's very popular variety game show that has aired for actually 11 straight years at once and with this numerous guests coming in each episode so that show also i believe is one of the factors that makes not just me but people fall more in love with korea as they also showcase the what we call it the beauty of the country to the eyes of the world it's a free promotion so basically they are like they make some very good advertising of the country throughout the show their cinematics, their videography. So this is something that I believe we in Malaysia can actually improve on in promoting our country as a desirable destination for tourists, for sure. 
you can learn a thing or two from them. Maybe we can make our own version of that variety store, such, uh, such as Running Man that uses their formula. So, you know, he might be a hit. Who knows, right? People like watching this kind of stuff, making fun of others. So, well, I guess um, that is all for my sharing session today. I hope this is topic actually uh, today actually explain on how I first met Korea and how it made me attracted to Korea. So tell me in the comments down below on how you first met Korea and what actually makes you attracted to Korea. I'll see which comment is good and you know I do something maybe as always thanks for watching and I hope to see you on the next video. Kurum dot metal bio and yeah